What is up, it's your boy Kate Sif Wins back with my October lineup. Basically, this is a video that's going to show what I'm going to be playing in the month of October. Without further ado, let's get into it. My first thing that I'm going to be playing will be some more Borderlands 3, obviously. I'm going to try to get all the characters at level 50. I've been doing a lot of farm with the one. But at the end of October, we're going to have the Bloody Harvest, which is a free DLC update. It's going to be a timed event. I've heard about a month and a half, so I don't know if this is going to be gone forever, but definitely jump into that. They got a new thing called Ectoplasm you can collect. I think some new legendaries and a Captain Haunt, which I guess is a dead version of Captain Tron boss at the end, but it's a free update and you will be able to download it sometime at the end of October, so I'll definitely be on you know, some videos of that as well as other videos on legendaries and other things like that. My next thing I'm going to be doing, I just started the 1st of October, would be Season 3 of Apex. Is I actually took a big break from Apex. I think that was good. It just made me feel good when I finally got on it the last few days. I just got to the max level of Season 2 on the last day within a few hours before it closed. But basically, it's a whole new map. You got a new character in crypto and just a... I guess a fresh new start, so I'll definitely be doing some videos on that. Next, and this is where October gets really loaded, at the end of the month, there's like within three or four days, three games I'm going to be playing. Um, one of them is Medieval. I'm going to be doing a walkthrough on that. I already have a demo walkthrough up on my channel if you want to check it out, but it, the demo is a free download. It's on PlayStation right now, but basically, Medieval is um, it's only $30, you know, $40 for the digital deluxe version, but it's only $30. I definitely would recommend picking it up. Um, it's an old PS1 classic game that I enjoyed from my childhood, and it's definitely a lot of fun. I definitely think it's worth it. I'll be doing a walkthrough on that. My next game will be Outer Worlds, and I cannot wait to dive into this one, have a lot of space exploration. I'm definitely getting, like, that Fallout feel in space, and hopefully they can excel on that, and I can play for a while. I'll be doing, a, I guess, a walkthrough on that. And my last game, I don't know if I'm going to be showing it or not. It just depends how I feel. I'm just so weird in these type of games. Is Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel 3. This is a JRPG. I played the first two this year. I just got introduced to this series. I really enjoyed it. But I feel like I'm going to play that on my own time, not recording with any pressure recording. But just because I like to enjoy it without you know, having to worry about all that stuff. Maybe later on, or a few parts that are cool, I might show on my channel. But I definitely do recommend the series. There's a total of four of them in this Trails of Cold Steel series. But I really did enjoy it. Um, last thing for end this um, little video is that I will not be having. Unfortunately, one game got knocked off the October slate, and that would be Call of Duty. I just didn't love the beta as much as I wanted to, and just too many games. I'll probably play it when it gets really cheap in price, but just not at this time. Just too many things going on, unfortunately. So, because in November I got other games I want to play, like Doom Eternal and Death Stranding. So, I'll definitely be loaded up. But this is my October slate. If you did enjoy the video, don't forget to. Subscribe, hit a like, and comment, and hopefully um, October can be even better than September. Thanks, and peace.